150 people. Uh, the entire city has been evacuated and is now under strict quarantine. The first known case of the virus was found after six-year-old twin sisters, Tiffany and Teresa Morrissey, were admitted to the hospital just weeks ago. Uh, the virus quickly spread among the hospital's medical staff, forcing the area to be quarantined and on high alert. With one of the twins dead, within days of contracting the virus, the surviving sister, Teresa, has made a full recovery, the only reported case of anyone showing any signs of immunity to the virus. Now, as one microbiologist believes that Teresa Morrissey is the key to finding a cure, that perhaps somewhere in her DNA lies the answer to this epidemic that has forced residents to abandon their homes and leave the city. And it's now being reported, I can tell you, that the surviving twin, Teresa Morrissey, is missing. She was last seen by her father at Oxford Station on Thursday, but was apparently lost during the chaos of the evacuation. We will bring you continued coverage of the story as it develops. For now, this case begs the question, where is Teresa Morrissey? Morning, Doctor. Your paperwork is in. You've been cleared to return to Oxford to find the missing girl. If your research is accurate, then this girl is the key to finding a cure. It's imperative that you find her. We don't want this thing going global. The girl's grandfather ran a farm not too far from the drop-off point. That's probably a good place to start your investigation. We've scheduled a train to take you into Oxford this afternoon. Good luck, Doc.
too much of the punch though. I've been throwing up all day. I know, I know, my own fault. Anyway, I'm gonna go have a nap. So good luck with your meeting tomorrow and I'll see you Thursday. I need you to fly home early. I'm so sick. I haven't left my bed all day.
listen, I don't want to have to hurt you, but I will. Last warning, leave now.